Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and today I'm going to be doing a YouTube video where I try out makeup products. Now, I went on a makeup spree today and got some new makeup, so let's try this stuff out. Keep watching the video. And make sure to subscribe and like this video, but if you don't like it then, oh well, I'm sorry. But, so, let's just get started with the video. Okay, so first I got this um, e.l.f. Mineral uh, Infused Face Primer, and it's in clear 83401, and it came in this little packaging right here, which is really cute, and I recommend all my subscribers that uh, e.l.f. products are really good makeup products because they are very cheap and they're really good quality. But this is a Mineral Infused Face Primer by e.l.f. And um, the multi-purpose primer preps your skin and fills in fine lines so makeup goes on evenly for a long-lasting matte finish. So it's good to have matte foundation. And I'm just going to take this off. And I'm going to do half of my face to show this stuff to see if it works. And this is the e.l.f. Primer. Hold on, I'm going to try to get it on my hands. So it came out like this, and I'm going to try it and see how it feels. I'm just smelling it. There's no smell to it, but I'm just seeing how this feels. It all of a sudden feels like very grainy which does not feel good but let's try this it just makes my skin compared to this side it feels the same but it does make my face wider for some reason I know it doesn't look like it but right now it does I'm gonna get my uh, mirror that way I can see what I'm doing and yeah so let's put this here so i can see what i'm doing it seems okay i don't know how i feel about it though but that's the elf mineral infused makeup primer and I think it's so cute how it comes in like that, but, and I'm going to try out this concealer that I got from Maybelline. Um, it's the Fit Me, and it comes with the Fit Me Matte and Poreless Foundation, and I'm just going to test this out, like swatch it, and hold on, I'll be right Okay, so immediately the concealer that's right there you can tell which one's concealer it seems pretty good and then I poured out too much foundation but this looks pretty good and I have to say that I really like how good it goes on and I'm just gonna see how this feels it feels like it applies very smoothly hold on I'm gonna apply this to my face <laughs> okay so you can tell I'm not going to go up to my forehead because that's too much that I am going to take off so you can tell it looks pretty good I have to say and it went on really nicely I don't know about the primer because it just doesn't feel like it's doing anything but hold on I think I see some I'm doing this with my fingers because I don't have my brush in here with me, but I have a Neutrogena face powder, and it eliminates shine for fresh looks, so I got everything matte for my face, and it looks like this, which I'm going to go put this on, and then we're going to see about the concealer in a minute okay hold on 
Okay, so I have the concealer on and I have it on my eyes and I have it underneath my eyes and on my nose. And I have the powder on the whole of the part that I did with the um the foundation and concealer. So my thoughts on this is it's really good. I like how matte it looks. It looks so good. And I think putting powder on it helps it too. I haven't had powder in a while, so I'm not really used to having powder on my face. Um, next, we're going to try eyebrows. I got this eyebrow kit. And there's two shades in it. And let me just show you. So it comes with a little brush. And it has those two shades. So I'm going to do the darker shade and I'll be right back with you. Okay, so I did my eyebrows and I don't really like how that looks, but it'll have to do. So now I'm going to go in with this eyeliner and it's a gel eyeliner. I'm just, I'm just going to see how it works. I'm not going to, um, like, you know, do anything major. So, I'll be right back with you. Okay, so I underlined the, um, my lash line. And I don't know if you can tell, but it looks pretty good. I like how it goes on. It comes on really thick. But, um, now we're going to go in with the e.l.f. eyeliner pen. And it looks like this. And I really like those little felt tips. So we're just going to do a uh, wing. And I'm going to see how this looks. Stuff, but it'll be okay. So okay, so I like this and it makes a really precise line. And I think it's really good. I don't know if y'all can tell. Yes, I am. So, this looks really nice. 
it looks way different in person. So, I think that's really cool. Hold on, let me get the cap. So, I really like this. And it looks so cute. I think it's the cutest thing ever. Um, but this looks really nice. It looks really nice in person and looks way better in person, too. So, that's a plus. So now we're on to contour. And this, oh my gosh, this looks so good. I'm surprised at how good this looks. Like, come on, look at this. So I'm going to try this out. don't know how it's going to go. But I'm just going to see how this works. So, yeah. I'll see you in a minute. Okay, so... This is the contour palette, and I like the contour. I know it looks a little bit messed up right now, but it looks good. And it apparently, the white shade, the very white shade right here, it is a highlighter. So, that's pretty cool. And, yeah, so, that's pretty nice. And, uh, there's two contour shades right there, and then there's two highlight shades. And it seems like this one is supposed to be under your eyes, so, I did that right there. And, I really like this makeup, and it's really good. So, last but not least is the eyeshadow palette and this is by hard candy and it's called um it's called birthday soup and it comes in these colors and i really like this because it comes with a white shade which is right here and comes with a red shade which is pretty cool and um black and black and gray and then it comes with a brown which I'll probably use that brown for my eyebrows because I don't really know how I feel about that eye shadow well the um eyeliner kit but this is what it comes with it comes with a mirror so you can see yourself and yeah so, this is pretty cool. Um, I'll do a YouTube video over the weekend and do a um, eyeshadow. I'll do a makeup look, makeup tutorial with this palette. So, make sure to uh, watch my YouTube video. And this comes in a little really cute case. I really like this. It makes me feel, I don't know. But... Elf products, they're really good because they have no animal testing, so that's really good, and that's really good right there. I don't know about the other ones. I guess I'd have to look at it. But this is, I use the shade 120, Classic Ivory, in that. And the eyeshadow kit is Dark 81303. And it comes in another shade. It comes in a lighter shade right over here. But I don't know how... My eyebrows are dark, so I can't really use that one. Um, the contour palette. And it'll tell you on all of them that there's no animal testing. So they don't do any animal testing on this. But... But I love how it gives you directions on how to do this with the contour palette. And this is what it comes in. It's a really cute package. You can tell that I've broken it. Because I had to get into it. But it says, use the darker contouring shades. Apply color in areas uh, you wish to achieve a slimming effect. Such as along the sides of the nose, between the tips of the nose, and the hollow of the cheeks, along the jawline, and along the hairline on the sides of your forehead. Use the matte brightening shade to add light lift. Add light lift and create defined angles on the top of your nose 
chin and center of the forehead. Use the highlighting shade on the top of the cheekbones, below the brow bone, Cupid's bow, and on the temples for an illuminating look. Looking glow. So, let's see how the nose, I didn't do the nose or Cupid's bow. So, I'm just going to see how that goes. So, we're just going to see how this looks. So this is the highlight. It's a pretty good highlight. I like it. And oh, that is so pretty. And you can tell that the highlight looks really good. I'm gonna use a lot of this <laughs> to get a more glowing effect. Oh, look at that. Hmm. That is so pretty. Let's see how a lot looks on Cupid's bow. And on the brow bone. Ooh, look at her. She is shining. Sorry, I've been watching like a lot of Jeffree Star. I really like him. I like his YouTube videos. I like Laura Lee. They do really good videos. And I like Nikki tutorials. She does really good. So this is the lasting effect. And I don't have eyelashes, my mascara on right now. But I'm going to be getting some white eyeliner and um, tomorrow I'm going to go get some fake eyelashes to wear. So that's going to be good. But anyways, um, that's the end of the video. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you're a new uh, viewer. And um, yeah, so this was my YouTube video and I hope you guys like it. So I'm pretty proud of the makeup that I got and I'm really excited that I got it. It was my for my birthday, which was Wednesday. So leave some um party hats or like, you know, those uh confetti stuff emojis in the comments if you've seen this video. And don't forget to tell me about what you thought about the video and everything in the comments. And I do read the comments. So make sure to give this a thumbs up. And see you guys in my next video. Bye.